15-year-old Kate Brody at Grand Blanc was living a dream until the COVID-19 crisis turned it into a nightmare. She was ready to tee off this week at the Masters for the National Drive, Chip, and Putt Championship. Once I found out that it got canceled, I was really bummed. Like, just everything that was going on, I was really looking forward to going. All my family was going to go. And then when I found out that it was canceled, I was super bummed. The National Finals are the fourth round of Drive, Chip, and Putt. Brody has been knocking on Augusta's door in the past, finally breaking through in her final year of eligibility. It was just so, it was so incredible. I was so excited finally that I made it. It was my last year in the drive chip putt. So just ending like my drive chip putt experience and getting to go to Augusta is a really good feeling. Brody comes from a golf family. Mom and dad, Jen and Doug Brody, run the pro shop at Warwick Hills, the home of the Allied Challenge. She would like to turn pro in the future. And she's had a vision of winning the DCP title on golf's biggest stage. It would just be unreal just to win at Augusta. That would be like one of my dreams. If, if I was standing over the putt, I'd just try to control my nerves and just just picture myself, just calm, calm down. And then i just try to make it and win. Brody will have a chance to win her national championship, but you'll have to wait until next year's Masters. The Dry Chip and Putt Committee has decided to bring back all the finalists. Ironically, Brody will be chasing the 14, 15 year old championship as a 16 year old. For WNEM TV5, I'm Scott Johnson.